Welcome back. In this video, I'll show you a very interesting feature in Power BI that is AI in BI, Artificial Intelligence in Business Intelligence. This feature is not present in all the BI tools. I can say only few of them. Power BI is one of them. Okay, what is this AI in BI? For that, I have to create one simple chart and then show you the demo. So I'll just create a stacked column chart for order date and sales. So order date and profit I'll pick up. Order date goes into access and I'll pick up profit. Profit will go into values. So you can drag and drop or you can select one of the same. Now I'll try to resize it properly. Yeah, that's the resize I've done. Now I'll just, I don't need these fields. I can just minimize those. So if you see, this is year wise profit and the profit is increasing definitely. Now, if I click on the fourth button, if I, if, I, if I click on the fourth button, I can show you the details by quarter wise and year wise. So these are all the quarters in all the years here. Now, suppose if you observe, let me just resize because the size is not visible. So I'll just go to view menu bar and I'll just go to customize current theme and I'll try to reduce the size to maybe lesser than that. 10 and apply and save. Yeah, so here you can see. Now what I want to show is 2016 quarter two. I know the, uh, you know, the screen is small, the size is small, but if you see the third quarter, third last quarter is having the le lesser profit as compared to fourth last quarter. So 2016 Q2 is having lesser profit than 2016 Q1. Now what could be the reason? Okay, because there are many fields here. If you observe, there are 21 different columns, category, uh, region, sales, profit, quantity, city, country, state, postal code, there can be any different reasons because of which the profit has come down. Suppose if I want to analyze, if I want to find out the root cause, why the profit has gone down. So very simple and very easy in Power BI. Just two button clicks and you'll get different options. Okay. So I can just right click on 2016 Q2 and there's an option given as analyze, explain the decrease. Once I click on explain the decrease, I'll be getting list of all the visuals one by one. And you can see how much is the decrease 34.25 as compared to previous quarter. Okay, so I'll just click on got it button. That is for the help. I'll just click on got it. And you can see these are different visuals which are created in just one button click. Okay, what this visual says, this will give you the different parameters and why the profit has come down. Let us see the first one. So first one, if I show you here, yeah. So this is profit based on region. If I read this one by year, quarter and region. So 2016 Q1 was this much profit, 2016 Q2 the profit came down. If I ask you which region was the responsible, so you see West region was having a profit minus 10.4 thousand. So that was a negative one. Which region was profitable? Only East region was profitable and how much is this one? So you can see the red color, green color and the blue color will tell you the you know legend part here. Now let us see one more example. Like this, you can keep on scrolling and easily, quickly find out the answers here. One more example. 2016 Q1 was the profit, 2016 Q2. Which category was having, uh, what was responsible for less profit? Technology, you see minus 11.3 thousand. The, the profit came down gradually or you can see, you know, on a large contain from technology. Whereas which one was profitable? Office supplies. So you see, if, I, if you try to find out by using some techniques and tricks, it will take a lot of time. But using this AI in BI, within few button clicks, you'll get the answers. Now, once you finish, suppose your manager has assigned this task to you and I've asked you to give the answers. What you can do is after 15 days, you can just click on this plus button and this visual would be added at the back end. You see, once I, once I again right click and click on analyze, explain the decrease. Yeah, so I think that is added already. You see, this visual is added. Let me just resize it properly. That's a visual. Now I said after 15 days, you have to add this visual. Why did I say that? If you give them immediately, then what is the use of you, your company? So what is the use in the company for you? So make sure that once you analyze the data and then you can add it. So if you observe the upper text is not added, upper text which was given written on the top, it was not added. It is just kept for you so that you can, when you're going for a presentation, you can display that. So I'll just right click here, select the option analyze and explain the decrease. And here, if you observe this particular text, which I want to say is not displayed. Okay, this one. So I can just click on add button. Do not give them easily. Otherwise, difficult to survive in the market. And I can just scroll and you can see that's a visual here. Okay, very, very simple visual, which is created. Now, this kind of animation, this kind of artificial intelligence is only present in Power BI. 
right? So I hope you have understood how to work on AI in Power BI. That's all for this video.